A new report set to be completed today will outline issues when it comes to protecting people with disabilities right here in Arizona. Our John Genovese live at the state capitol this morning. And John, the governor expected to see this for the first time today. Yeah, today after months in the making and the people behind this report say the system for protecting the disabled in our state and reporting abuse is broken in this report. They will make several specific recommendations among those expected a better system for record keeping by adult protective services, more education on recognizing the signs of abuse and reporting it and strengthening whistleblower protections. This all of course comes just weeks after a 29 year old incapacitated patient at Hacienda Health care gave birth. Phoenix police making an arrest in that case. Now state representative Jennifer Longden says what happened there highlights issues the disabled community has known about for a long time. Now people are looking at it and that's important. We need to take advantage of this moment to get this important work done. And uh, the officials in that report say the first priority should be completely overhauling the system the state uses to analyze and track abuse complaints. That's certainly important, guys. In just the last week, we've heard of more potential problems in that process when it comes specifically to Hacienda. All right, John, obviously a lot of questions we know, but thank you for that live report and clearing yeah. some of them up for us.